All right, I found these on eBay and I thought they were interesting. Um, these are OP07 parts. So these are Texas, they're marked to Texas Instruments OP07. Now these are uh, laser trimmed at the wafer to have very, very low offset voltages. So they have, uh, according to the data sheet, uh, maximum of 75 microvolt offset from, uh, uh, and they have a low drift, they're very, very stable. They're just really, really excellent parts. Well, somebody on eBay had uh, 20 parts for $1.88. Um, if you've ever priced these things, they're about six bucks each, I think. I don't know, something like that. They're not cheap parts, so get 20 of them for a buck 88. I thought, hey, that's a great deal. <laughs> so they're either a great deal or a complete scam. So I thought I would test them out finally. They've been laying on my bench for a while. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hook up a circuit that's going to look like it's going to look like this over here. Um, this is just a, 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 a buffer. So whatever voltage we put here, we should get here. And if we put ground here, then ground will be here. The op amp will do everything it can to make ground here. And so this is the offset voltage, the differences between the plus and the minus. So um, if we measure the voltage here and here, they should be within 75 microvolts um, with one of these parts. Well, other op amps have some type of offset here and you'll, you'll measure that offset here. Um, you could you could probably measure it here, but you're kind of affecting the op amp. Um, but but here they should they should be uh, more buffered away. Uh, but we can measure it both places. So um, let's go ahead and start with a uh, uh, a part that has the same pinout. So this is a uh, an LM uh, seven forty one. Okay, seven forty one is a very old op amp, been around forever. Um, kind of started the whole op amp craze. <laughs> um, anyway. Let's uh, let's go ahead and measure the uh, the offset voltage here. We'll go between the uh, ground and the out. And uh, let's see here. We need to make sure we have everything hooked up correctly. And let's go between these two. Wow, this one's measuring really really good. <laughs> All right. Yep. I am measuring it correctly. Okay. If we go up to the uh, meter up here, we are measuring uh, 50 microvolts, 46 microvolts. So, wow. Uh, this 741 is doing a really good job. <laughs> wow. I guess you can just buy 741s and you can be done, right? That, but that's that's not going to always be the case. Uh, let's pull out this 741. Let's let's measure uh, let's measure another one just to see what uh, what kind of range we get. Uh, yeah, here's a here's a 741. I'll pop him in. Got to bend the legs correctly so they go in circuit here. I'm running at uh, plus or minus 12 volts. There we go. All right, let's measure this one for for offset voltage. Yeah, there's that's more like what I would think. I think we got lucky with that other one. Uh, this one is measuring uh, 1.3 millivolts. That's about what I would expect with a 741. About one to two millivolts, somewhere somewhere in that range, okay? Um, let's go ahead and measure one more. I was really surprised about that one. It is a, I wonder, that's one made in Korea. This one's made in Malaysia. Maybe Korea knows how to make them better. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Let me get another one out here. This one looks even, even different, or this one, that's not a, that's about a 741. We'll grab a different part here. Uh, okay, this is a 741. 741, let's pop it in the circuit here. And measure the measure the offset on it. And yeah, there we go. This one is this one is around uh, two. Oops, not that, that up there. Around two, uh, two millivolts, okay? So, yeah, so one and a half to two millivolts, that's probably a pretty reasonable range for a 741. I wanna measure that. I wanna measure that first one, because that's just a phenomenal part. I might have to put a little gold star on him. <laughs> okay, this is, this is the Korean version. Oh, it has, it has a 741 TC. I don't know, maybe it's a special run or something. Let's measure. 
Let's measure that one again. Maybe I just was measuring it wrong. Yeah, there we go. No, same thing. We're measuring uh, measuring 40, uh, 40 microvolts. So, wow. Yeah, that part's a superstar. Nice. Okay. But what if you wanted that all the time, right? Well, then you would buy one of these OP7s, right? These OP7s are, are trimmed, and you pay a lot of money for that, right? So let's get one out here, and we'll pop him in the circuit. And that's why I wanted them. I mean, that screaming deal, a buck eighty-eight for twenty of them. Okay, so let's measure him. Yeah, look at that, one point two five millivolts. That sounds an awful lot like a seven forty-one. An awful lot like a 741 makes you might think that they just took some 741s and put a different label on them, huh? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. And then try to sell them. Well, unfortunately, or, or fortunately for me, they weren't trying to sell them for a ton of money, right? I only paid a buck 88 plus shipping. Uh, let's go ahead and measure. Let's go ahead and measure a different one. See what kind of... Uh, offset we get on him and look at that look at that 1.3 millivolts yeah these are 741s these are just 741s rebranded um, uh, I've contacted the seller and said hey <laughs> you know these aren't OP 07s these are not go can I have my money back uh, I mean it's, that, it's tiny amounts of money I kind of did this on purpose um, I was either gonna get super lucky and be really happy that I had 20 OP 07s, okay? That would have been just a great, great, great story. Or I would have gotten ripped off and be able to make a YouTube video, which is a great, great, great story. <laughs> so anyway, buyer beware, yes, if you get parts from China, very likely they could have been remarked. And uh, yeah, these are just these are just 741s that are remarked. They're probably they're probably not even good 741s. They're probably Chinese versions of the 741 and and just remarked. Now, who got ripped off, okay? It's completely plausible that the seller thought they were OP 07s because he just bought them, you know, he bought a big box of stuff and that's what these were and that's what he paid for them, right? Could be that somebody was building a product and they needed OP 07, so this is what was supplied and this is the leftover inventory. So that guy got screwed up because <laughs> uh, they aren't what they were supposed to be. Anywhere. Uh, moral of the story, buyer beware, especially out of China. <laughs>